I'm Sophie Louth and I'm a PhD student here at the University of Birmingham. I use titanium in an alloy form called titanium 64 where it's mixed with vanadium and aluminium to create an alloy that has interesting properties and is used a lot in medical applications. So titanium and particularly the alloy can be made into a powder which then enables us to use it in the 3D printers. So they work by putting a layer of powder down onto, into the machine which then is scanned by a laser to create uh, intricate shapes and then another layer of powder is added and relazed and this adds up to create a complex shape. This is great for us because we can make complex shapes that we can be used in medical devices. In my research I'm really interested in hip replacements. So traditional hip replacements look like this. So they're made of a solid metal and this is great because they're nice and strong. However all the body weight of the person travels down the metal and this is, results in none of the force going into the bone. Bone responds significantly to force and it will re remodel depending on the force. So if there's no force, the bone will disappear and this can result in a lot of loosening of hip replacements. So I'm creating new hip replacements that have a more complex structure like this. So the bone can grow inside the structure and so the force from the body weight can go inside the bone rather than into the metal and this means that the bone doesn't wear away so we have a much stronger fixation. My research will help the elderly population particularly because that is the main area of the population that have hip replacements and they are particularly susceptible to breakages in bones so enabling the bones to remain strong is really important for that population.